Hi guys, I'm Luke from Alive Health and Fitness and welcome to this week's educational. So I'm going to be running you through goal setting and the importances behind goal setting as you step into your training. The reason why we need to set solid goals is because it gives you something to focus on throughout your sessions and when you're training. When the going gets tough, you can think about it and that's what's going to get you through to the next level. Now, what we use is this simple acronym to get us through uh, when we're setting our goals. So we've got SMART. S stands for simple, so we need to keep our goals simple, make sure that we know exactly what we're aiming for and that we can use that to get us through that next session. Measurable, making sure it's measurable so it's not just something that's plucked out of thin air. Make sure that you can measure it, whether it be a weight loss, whether it be time, whether it be a distance or something like that, or even a, a date to, to work towards so it's measurable. Next one we got is A, achievable, make sure it's totally realistic. If it's not achievable, it's not a good goal. Ah, is it realistic? So, is it something that is going to be right for you? You know, as a person, you've got different strengths and weaknesses. Make sure that that goal is realistic for you to achieve with your strengths and weaknesses. T stands for time frame. So, is it an achievable time frame, or do you have a time frame altogether? An important time I think to look at when you're doing your setting your time frames is to make sure that there's like a date that you can't move. So for example, a birthday, an event, or something like that. So you're not just keep pushing your goals back and pushing your goals back. When we're setting our goals, it's really good to put different goals as far as the timeline's concerned. So what we've got is we've got our short, medium, and long-term goals. Now we want to make sure we're using this SMART acronym when we're setting our short, medium, long-term goals to make sure that they're the right goals for us. So with a short-term goal, we're looking at about two to three weeks. With the medium duration, you're looking at about two to three months to set your goals. With the long term, you're looking at around 12 months or above, depending on what your goal is. Once you've used all of this that we've spoken about today, I want you to make sure you write it down. Writing it down makes sure that you're gonna, it's real and you're gonna be using it as much as possible. Put it somewhere visible as well so you're constantly reminded about your goals. Thanks for listening to this week's educational. I'm Luke from Alive Health and Fitness. Hope this helps you set your next goals. Come visit us on the website or pop in the gym and say good day.